Hello my beautiful MK Love fam, welcome back to another episode. It's Melanie Kate Love here and I'm sitting on the floor because my power is out and I have been waiting for about an hour. So if my fairy lights come back on and my fan goes on, we'll just go with the flow and I'm just gonna, we're just gonna sit on the floor and do weekly angel guidance today. So talk about a divine intervention. So thank goodness for natural lighting. Um, today, this is weekly angel guidance from the 14th to the 20th of January. As you guys know, we are still in eclipse season, which is eclipsing some major life, life transformations for you. So I'm so interested to hear about what does that actually mean for you? There has been lots that's been happening in my life too. So I can't wait to read the chat and the comments below to find out more about what you're going through. So without further ado, this is a general reading using the Shadowscapes Tarot. And this is for all of the signs. So let's get down to business, shall we? So we're gonna be going through two phases of the moon. On Monday, well, Monday through Thursday, we move into the first quarter of the moon. This is the action phase of the moon, and this is your affirmation. I take inspired action and allow it to flow with ease. Remember last week where we were literally like planning exactly what we wanted to, and now we're taking action on that. Then from Friday to Sunday, we move into the, no, Friday? Yeah, Friday to Sunday, we move into the give us moon. This is when we trust. And your affirmation is, I trust the process as everything is working out for me. No matter what has been going on, the universe is taking you off one train track and popping you on another. However that looks for you, you need to surrender to that process and it will set yourself free. The universe knows best. And then I heard that song from Tangled. Mama knows best. Dun, dun, dun. Even though I don't like that scene. Mama knows best. It's like the universe knows best. Trust it. I've been trusting it for a very long time now and I can't even tell you everything that has happened recently. Money is literally flowing to me in avalanches of abundance. I feel like I finally broken through from that beautiful blockage that taught me so much and I'm so happy and grateful that I went through that. And the next blockage I'm going through right now is my body. I'm getting my dream body this year. And it's so interesting because in Weekly Angel Guidance, we've been talking a lot about finding your coach, finding someone that can help you get to where you need to. And I, you know, surrendered to that. And I was like, you know, I have to do something that I have never done before. Um, yeah, so I am in an eight week program. <laughs> I felt like I needed to push myself because I'm pushing my clients pretty hard and I was like, I need someone to push me too. So I'll keep you posted and let you know how all of that goes. So that's what's happening Monday to Thursday, action. And then Friday to Sunday, we're trusting that we're planting all of these beautiful seeds and things are going to manifest in our reality. So let's see what we need to know for Monday. One card angels for my beautiful MK love fan. Oh. Ah, we got this again. We have the two of pentacles. This is all about finding your balance. If you're taking massive inspired action, then you need to balance that with some heavy, heavy self care, some self love practices. That means like taking a bath. That means going out in mother nature. That means making a delicious smoothie. That means finding a new dress. This is my new dress. Thanks to my beautiful mom. <laughs> Um, she did the Kamari method. You know how I spoke about that last week? Oh, that was the other thing that inspired the weight loss. Not the weight loss, because it's not about weight. It's about being toned and it's being about fit and healthy. Because when I showed you that little clip from my Kamari series, I was like, oh my gosh, my face used to be a lot, you know, different. And I was like, what was I doing back then? Oh, I was going to reform on Pilates five days a week. No wonder I look friggin' amazing. And so I was like, oh, how do I get back to that? How do I find my balance? And that is what your angels are asking you to focus on for Monday. Ooh, that's exciting. Um, I heard a song, but then I messed it up. I lost it. All right. Can we have a card for Tuesday, please? Did something fall? No? Yes, it did. Tuesday. 
Oh my gosh, we have the Ace of Cups. This is this brand new emotional journey that you're embarking on. So you guys are making a lot of change because, hey, didn't we get the King of Cups last week? Oh, let me just check my screen. Hold on. Yes, we did. Oh my God. I love Weekly Angel Guidance. We got the King of Cups on Saturday last week. Oh my gosh. And your angels are like, honey, you are starting a brand new journey. This is this new fabulous you. So what does this new fabulous you look like in terms of like, no, how does she feel in terms of emotions? She's not going to allow people to walk all over her anymore. It's like she's got that backbone. I feel like I'm channeling like some inner like soul sisters. Like, you know, when, um, when I think of like sister act, joyful, joyful Lord, we adore thee, God of glory, Lord, I awesome for thy flowers before thee, every as the son of God. Da, 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 da. I'm channeling, I'm feeling like real, like real, like gospel kind of rock, even though I'm not religious, but I love that type of music. I'm channeling like this new fabulous you. It's like you're just like, I want to break free. It's like you're broken free and you're like, how does this new fabulous me act in these situations? You know, because she is not like the 2018 18 woman or gentleman. We've got a couple of men that watch my channel. We've got two Justins and we've got my Sean. Sean writes to me every single time I send him an email. <gasps> now, this is what happened to me this week. I was like, oh my God, Sean. Yeah. All right, Wednesday. This is a pretty good week. I feel incredible. What do I need to know for Wednesday? Thank you very much. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Page of Wands. I think we had that last week too. Let me check my screen. Page of Wands. Yeah, we had this for Wednesday last week. That's so interesting that we've got that energy coming back again. So this is like, this is like you're the leading lady of your own life. You know that scene from The Holiday? It's like, why are you acting like the best friend? You should be the leading lady of your own life. And now you are acting like the leading lady of your life or the leading gentleman of your life. <laughs> um, and it's like people are taking no notice of you. And it's like they're noticing where you're at because they can stay, they know where you've come. It's like they've been following your journey for like years on Instagram. You're like, you remember that time, Mel, when, you know, you started off as raw nourishment and you're talking about food and, you know, you healed your body through blah, 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 blah. And it's like people are watching. People are watching. They're not always commenting or liking, but people are watching. So it's like people are like really taking note as to where you're at. And you should be so happy and grateful now that you're at this stage. Because it's like you can be recognized. And interesting, as soon as I said that, there's two. So this is a partnership. There's two birds outside sitting on this trampoline and this house that I'm house sitting in. And, but they're facing two different ways. So it's like the opposing it's like people appreciating, people are appreciating your unique differences and they're celebrating this new fabulous you. Wow. I feel like this week is like, the energy is like, okay, you don't need to spend too much time on these cards. Every week is so different. Last week you made me cough. <gasps> There's just a lot going on last week. There was major pain. This week I don't feel that at all. All right, Thursday. Woo! We got the magician card. I got the power. I feel like we had that as well. Did we? Was that in a client's reading? <laughs> Maybe it was. All right. So the magician is this this chapter. It's like, oh, and then I heard, do you see what I see? Do you see what I see? What is that of? That's like a car, that's not a car ad in Australia. I don't know the rest of the song, but it's like people maybe not, maybe people don't understand. Maybe they do, maybe they don't. I feel like you have a select few of people that really understand this new vision and this new chapter of everything that you're creating. They're the ones that you have to hold dear to your heart. They're the ones that are going to lift you up when you fall, you know? And they, these are people that need to, that are fabulous for like raising your vibration, but also maintaining it. It's interesting, as soon as I thought of that card, it reminds me of Peter, because we have been constantly up-leveling in our lives. He up-leveled in one area, and then I like matched him, and then it was just like, we're constantly like growing and growing. So it's like up-leveling, but this is also like having the power to, to literally script your dream life. Like you have the power to script exactly what that looks like. And your, your angels are like, yeah, honey, you got this. 
because all the delicious goodness that you could possibly ever imagine is already very deep within your soul. Tap into it, activate it and unleash your potential. Wow, this is kind of feels like a motivational kind of week. All right, Friday. What do we need to know for Friday? I'm so hot. Usually I have the air conditioning on, but not today. But we just film on the floor and that's just what happens. There it is, there it is, there it is. Ooh, we got the Queen of Wands. Cause I'm the Queen of the Night. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Don't make no difference if I'm wrong or right. Da -da. Da -da 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 da 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 Wow, gosh, Whitney can sing. So this is like playing the, the beat of your drum. Wow, I heard this again. This was in a client's reading too. Playing the beat of your drum, however that looks, using your creative talents and abilities to work with and for people that you truly love and that love and adore you. This is you in your element. This is you celebrating this new fabulous you because you're taking action and you're like, Oh, when the wind is blowing in your face. Oh shit, what's the next one? Don't let emotions roam. People always speculate. Say they say things they don't know. Wait till I see my smile. Yeah, wait till they see your smile, right? Because you are on top of the world oh my gosh um i'm walking on sunshine whoa and it's time to feel good yeah whoa you are on fire this week the energies it's interesting that we're only getting one this is all about you putting yourself forward this new fabulous you that you were creating and the energy is electrifying it's electrifying you better say bum 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 because i need a man no you don't need a man he compliments your life. <laughs> you don't need anyone. And then I was told to look at the clouds and there's something in the clouds. Um, in the clouds, <laughs> this, is, this has never happened before because I never film in the window. I usually film over there. Um, and it's like, um, you know when someone goes to blow out their candle? It kind of looks like a pig's face. But, and then, then it's like, it's like make that wish. What does that mean? Signaling, blowing, it's not breathing. Just keep breathing and breathing and breathing. I know you want to. It's not breathing, it's like it's you blowing. Little pig, little pig, let me in. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin, and I huff and I puff, and I'll blow your house down. It's like creating solid foundations. That's weird. Channeling a pig in the clouds, everyone. <laughs> this is new. Just keep breathing, breathing, breathing. All right, Saturday. What do we need to know for Saturday? This is an interesting week. I love the energy. It's electrifying. And then I just instantly looked um, to this picture that's on my wall that was sent to me from the beautiful Marla Collective who made me this gorgeous bracelet that I wear. I haven't taken it off, actually. Um, I can't remember the lady's name from the Mala Collective, but she sent me this beautiful rose gold print on this gorgeous, gorgeous card, and it says, I am enough. So you feel, I'm feeling that you know that you are enough and that you feel worthy of all this delicious success and you feel worthy of exactly where you're at. And then I heard, sail away, sail away. Sail away. It's an old song from like the 90s. Okay, woo, okay, now, oh my gosh, and now we have the Ten of Cups. The Ten of Cups is like this beautiful, this balance, this yin and the yang, this divine partnership where you feel free and everything is on, everything is going exactly the way 
it just feels good there's a new path that you're in and you're breathing with ease and you you just feel so in your power but you feel so free and you feel so liberated and you're like oh my gosh i am enough it feels amazing to be in this stage i am so happy and grateful now that i love the absolute shit out of myself because i am worthy of all this success i am worthy of avalanches of abundance i am worthy of this beautiful equal partnership where the other person um loves me unconditionally unconditionally i will love you unconditionally there is no this i don't know the words i will love you unconditionally this is also about you loving yourself unconditionally as well there's no conditions to love people just put them on it and that's learned behavior from your childhood you are free i'm like a bird i want to fly away and then two other cards just came up right then and they are the page of cups oh i love this card i think i pulled this from my client um eva the page of cups is like oh, wow there's so many emotions going through this it's just emotions taking me over caught in a sorrow no you're not caught in that sorrow anymore you've you've broken free um so this is like taking time to just breathe in and every time i see this it reminds me of like just taking time to just breathe to drink that beautiful cup of chai tea which reminds me that i need to buy another bag from tea and spice um and this is just breathing with ease and ariana grande just keep breathing and breathing and breathing it's like what what makes you breathe with ease you know what what vibration what self-love practices allow you to just breathe with ease i feel like this week is all about balance and that's what we've been talking about for a long time now finding that balance maybe this is your word for 2019 is balance what does balance look like for you in 2019 because this is what you're working towards finding this balance in relationships balance in your self love balance in love for yourself instead of being just um conditional now it's unconditional it's like finding this balance that was a big tangent just for the page of page of cups but i just feel like you're finding your balance maybe you're trying something completely new that gives you this new sense of like oh, how do you do that exercise is a fabulous way to raise your vibration and to manifest super flip and quick like i mean quick i think you'd be shocked if if you found out what i have manifested recently and i don't want to tell you just yet i think i kind of want to save it till the end of eclipse season <laughs> um because it is super powerful and you're on this beautiful beautiful journey and the other card is judgment i feel like this is allowing the judgment of other people to just fall by the wayside and and it's like you um don't stop me now cuz i'm having a good time yeah you're not allowing other people to to waver into your vibration and into your personal space I have no idea how hot it is, but it's very, very, very hot. Um, this is a new for a weekly angel guide. Do you think a tarot card? What is this card? Oh, you won't look at that one then. Um, <laughs> well, I will. I'm just going to show you. What is this one? The nine of swords. So this is like where you have been. It's like that judgment. I feel like the judgment was this, and it's like you're not going to stop me anymore because I'm taking my power back this year. I'm finding my balance. You are not going to dictate how I live my life. What a beautiful week. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for you. Please comment down below and let me know what came up for you this week. If there was any cards in particular that just like hit the heart chakra, tell me which card hit the heart chakra this week. Was it the 2 of pentacles, the ace of cups, the page of wands, the magician, the queen of wands, the 10 of cups, the page of cups, the judgment or the 9 of swords? Which one just made you go yes mel i totally get it so i just want to wish you all the love in the world for a truly beautiful week i just feel like you're on this 
you're you're embarking on this new fabulous you and you are taking inspired action remember monday to thursday is about taking massive inspired action which is in alignment with your true authentic self everything that you want to focus on for this month which is laying the foundations for eclipse season which is this six month period that we're in from now until june the next um a lot of eclipse starts on the 8th of july this this year but this time here is literally solidifying the foundations that you're building for the next six months solidifying the foundations for the next two or three decades this is not like anything to be messed around so whatever you're taking massive inspired action with this week is going to change your life it's literally going to change your life so when you get to friday to sunday that's where you trust that this is changing your life. Maybe you don't see this life that you're creating yet, but you are planting seeds. You know, it takes time. You have to water them and talk to your plants and go, I love you, I love you, I love you. Like I talk to this plant all the time. You know, you just have to, you have to breathe with ease. You just, oh, just keep breathing and breathing and breathing. Just breathe and your balance will be here. How do I... I don't even know what the word is for this week. I'll figure it out and I'll, you probably already know from seeing the thumbnail, but I'll figure it out in between. Anyways, my love, sending you so much love, so much love. If you're struggling and you feel like you need extra help on your journey and you're like, Mal, I don't know what's happening. This happened and this happened and I don't know what's happening. Check out my free exclusive training and I'll help you heal that emotional pain. It's a 20 minute video, which has got gosh it is incredible it's the most information that i've ever given in such a concise video um but it's truly going to help change your life and if that's something that you're looking for please check that out because i would love to help you out um yeah and until next week follow me over on instagram um and i'll chat to you there if you already follow me on instagram you would have seen my little q a segment <laughs> Um, for this week and I think Delphi sent me a question which en ended I ended up in tears <laughs> um, So go and check that out. I'll put it over. I would have saved it over on my highlights So go and check that little Q&A out on my highlight and I'll be talking to you over there That's probably where I'm most active throughout the week and Yeah, I can't wait to see you next week because next week is when we have the lunar eclipse so that's the tail end of the solar eclipse so Get ready for that please don't mess around oh my gosh do not mess around do not delay do not get into that fear junkie stage you know you need to become this this freedom lover this freedom lover where you choose love over fear because who gives a shit if you fail because if you fail you're going to learn something from it and there is nothing wrong with that you are on the right path surrender to the process however that works and repeat after me i am so happy and grateful now that i'm restoring balance in my life in 2019 this is my year this is going to be my best year yet boom all right my loves on that note i will see you next week have a magical 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 week oh my gosh i sound like from disney we used to say that all the time. That's like, this is Disney magic. This is Melanie speaking. Have a magical evening. That is so weird. I never say magical. That's crazy. Anyways, we're ch channeling the magic. Um, oh, and, 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 and I know I've kind of wrapped this up, but then I thought of something else. I've created a um, Spotify playlist for weekly angel guidance. If you hear songs whenever I'm presenting weekly, presenting, yuck. Whenever I'm, whenever you're watching Weekly Angel Guidance, please pop them into the Spotify playlist. I've put it on Collaborative. I've actually put every single one of my public playlists on Collaborative. So please add any song that you want into it. Every time you do, which is interesting because one of you added a song in German and every time I hear it, I, I cry because I'm like, I have German viewers. Like, this is so amazing. I want to hear your songs. No joke. I listen to them. They're the only playlist I listen to. Um, so yeah, please go and check me out on Spotify, follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye-bye-bye! Bye, my love!